So, welcome to another episode of Factorial 45. Next one will probably be... Oh, seriously. I want to delay that down. But probably a server two or something. Uh, but for now, we're gonna stop the machine for wor of working. So, these two need to be gone. Oh yes, steel can still continue. But, uh, so we have the belts going out. This is going to be one big mess too. So I don't want the, the the robots to be in my way of removing them. I'm gonna move that, and there's another one here somewhere. You, thank you. And that's gone. So it is less likely that will they will uh, take stuff away from here. Well, the uh, destruction. The uh, I don't know. When I well, well I'm uh take one. Oh, there's a full iron chest of stuff there. Well, I'm uh, removing all the stuff right here. You don't fill up the chest, please. Thank you. So why I'm removing this? Well, it's quite simple. To get up to to get the iron up to that part, and uh, seriously, how much chest of those are there? To get the iron up to the new uh, science outpost, so we can make stuff right there. Also, all the other stuff in the base. Oh, holy, that's a lot of stuff we have. Uh, store chest. So basically, hello robots, where do you live? Right there, All right. So please make a lot of chest here. Make a storage chest, please. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> that was simple. So we just need to remove a lot of this stuff. So you can apparently remove. This stuff without any problems. Where are my robots? Did I really put them in a chest? Well, that's gonna take a while then. Robots! Come back here. So how much robots can we handle? I think we can handle 50 without a problem. So, alright. Um, then I'm just gonna remove all the stuff that's right here. So, you two. You. I really like to get the stone still working, but that's not gonna happen. And then removing you so also the oil pipes need to be rerouted and that kind of stuff so i'm not gonna work on that but it's gonna take a while for me to get all this right come on robots keep on going uh also wanted the stone to continue so i'm gonna run the stone now through the proper things and remove that and then remake the stone thing so we can have stone going since if the stone keeps on going we can now uh, make more landfills. And you, and you. And you, come on. How much armor is there? Wow. I have a lot of stuff in the chest toward right here that I didn't know about. So, uh, we're gonna remove almost all of this stuff. So it's gonna take a while. Um, I'm gonna remove a little bit more off camera and then when we're gonna construct a new area, uh, this part, so when I'm done removing enough, um, I'm gonna be back. So yeah, um, here we are. <laughs> it feels so empty. We could remove these old ones because we have a new place where the, this stuff is go is going to be placed so okay delete that this is going to be this is the fuel so let's say coal no no, no let's say um where is the boiler boiler um so this is um the creation of steam so steam power steam confirm and then we set to this one, we set science. Science specs confirms science specs. And then the science specs needs our iron and that kind of stuff, of course. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cheat a little bit, Sarda. So we used to have... <laughs> yeah, always great that I do that kind of stuff. Anyway, um, they, they, they turn on the noise directly and they are not my neighbors, so it's pretty annoying that they do that. 
Why are they doing it? It's not really an emergency, emergency, I think. It's, they're just doing it anyway, just to annoy me. So what we're gonna do is just change this a little bit. So uh, we need I in a second. So hello you, and then we're gonna use I in a second. And steel needs to be turret. Then we're gonna run this through, run this through. To the right, you to the right. I rather right have these next to each other, I guess, or not. That doesn't matter. Um, and then we have this line that we need to go under. And we need to get to the place right here, so that's a pretty big line. Uh, I guess this one was the iron line, so we're gonna connect the iron up first. The middle one is coal plus stone, and I need to find out which one was coal, which one was stone, because they have a priority. I can remove this little part. Anyway, we have a second iron line that we have right here. So what we're gonna do is cheek in a little bit, and just let the second iron line hook up to this iron line, if I can, like this. And then we are going to use a belt balancer. Like that to make sure that the belt is balanced. So now it's outputting iron and that kind of stuff. So do you have somewhere empty wall where I can put this stuff in? Please, like that. Yeah, I don't know what to put this stuff here. Right, so an iron line and a copper line, and then a copper one also needs to go that way. So let's hook that up. Um, so we have basically stone dings, and then copper one, two, three. Four, so we want it on the first one. One, two, three. So we want on this line we want copper. Let's see if we can make it. Probably not. Oh, we can. It's nice. So this one is putting iron in the base, and that's going to take quite a while. Oh, some speed modules. What nice. We had 150 speed modules or something, so that's nice. Um, also, we need oil stuff, so I'm not sure about oil. Let's check which oil needs to go where. So we have petroleum, that's the one of the first. So this first one is going to be petroleum. Let's see if we can steal petroleum out of the base. Are uh, we going to make petroleum production somewhere eventually? But not at this moment. So the oil stuff will be redone. Petroleum. Where would that be? Where did we get brought petroleum from? Just from the from the line I guess I do not know so I guess right here I get I, I got petroleum from so we're gonna grab it right there then what we already could do we should try to make it a little bit close to the to the to the lines of this well further so they're pretty close to each other so the the, the lubricant and the petroleum So here we have lubricant. And eventually we need four lines. So, and we also need four lines of this one. For now we cannot supply four lines. So that's not a problem. So uh, let's see. First. Second. Third goes there. So this one was petroleum. I don't have enough stuff for it. So let's walk into the base and see if our robots can give me the stuff that I need. It's all dumped in here, so all the stuff is in here. There's quite a lot of stuff at the moment. So this, there's also a chest full of uh, rocket control units and low density things. I also launched another rocket, so we have um, almost 2,000. Somewhere we need to have 2,000 of those things, but I don't know where. But we have enough of that. Um, so, this used to be sulfuric acid, that's not needed anymore. That's gone, so good. Also this one is not connected anymore and whoosh. It's gonna take a while to connect it all up, I guess. So first, uh, petroleum. All right, I don't wanna do this weird corner, but let's do it like that. So now petroleum is in there. The second wall will be sulfuric acid. Let's uh, 
I'll just do it like this. No, that cannot be. So one, two, three. You the that 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 that. So you are going to be sulfuric acid. Let's see if we can grab that. That's from this place. We do it like this. So this would be sulfuric acid. So there's a second one, and a third one would then be um, lubricant, I guess. We're doing it right, I guess. I guess the third one is lubricant. So let's hook it up to lubricant and let's see how that's doing. If that will keep the system running. Not only that, we also have lubricant needed above there. So let's hook that lubricant back on. So the normal base is also powered by lubricant now. The normal base also needs sulfuric acid. That's right there. I don't know what these lines. Oh, that was red, green, and blue um, packs. But we don't have that, so we cannot connect that up anymore. So with this one, we're gonna get to this side a little bit. And we go down. Uh, this was sulfuric acid, so this one. So we hook that up. So now there's also sulfuric acid in the base itself. And now um, we only need to put these ones up. And that's not a, a hard job to do unless you do it wrong like I did. Alright, and we don't have enough pipes. Ooh, uh, yeah, I see what I did wrong at least. I took the left pipe and I thought it was the right pipe. So now we need to do all the new pipes in the old system. And that's all. <sighs> that's, that's a pain. Because that's a real pain. Because I thought it was the right, right ones. You shouldn't be like this. Because the pipes are one, three. So first one is going to be petroleum you and you so like that the only problem now is that it's not connected the right way so we need to kind of start over and try to pump do we have a pump let's grab a pump you need a tank and I need a pump gonna get a tank and a pump don't know where you're gonna get that from but doesn't matter tank and a pump thank you then we're gonna do is try to pump the, um, the, 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 the lubricant out of there. So it's quite simple, you put the pump, pump down, make sure that the pump has electricity, which is going to be a big problem here, right here. It's a long way no electricity, like that. So now that will pump lubricant into the tank and out of the, the pipes, and the pipes will dry out. And even these pipes will all dry out, so I don't need to rebuild them hopefully so we keep that pump running for a little while and I meanwhile I'm just gonna put all these in place and hopefully the lubricant uh, system will work perfectly all right um so this one is connected there it's connected this can we follow it a little bit so this one is connected right there Connected there, there, here's all fine. The pressure seems to be gone, and it should be sulfuric acid. What? Wait, it's the third one, second one. I messed it all up. All right, so again, we need a pump. This is this is great, guys. This is great, showing me how to mess things up. All right, so we need a pump, a tank. We're gonna pump it into the system later on, I guess. So two, two, two pumps, two tanks, please. One tank, I need another one, please. Come on, tank and pump, another one, another one, come on. We already have those. Yeah, thank you. Let's pump till the thing's empty, and then see if I can do in the proper way do some things around this place so you should be 
which connect the pumps up. Please pump out this one for you. For the other one, it's going to be this pipe. Although this is lubricant and we can probably pump lubricant. It's a better way to do like this. This way we have one tank with lubricant. All right, so now it's tanking out the, the, the stuff in the pipes and the pipes will be empty at least. Last, whatever you want to pronounce it. So you and you. All right, so this, this pipe is going empty. This pipe is going empty soon. So then we need to watch if our pipes are empty. Maps, that was a horrible idea. That wasn't the map button. It seems like all the pipes are empty, so that's good. So then again, this pipe, the first pipe, um, basically needs sulfuric. So the red one will be sulfuric acid. There's apparently still lubricant in there, so we're gonna keep it working, I guess. Or not. Try to do it by hand a little bit. This one still has sulfuric acid, empty sulfuric acid. Do we need to reload for that or something? So save game, load game. I really hate that. It's just, look, there's still something in there somewhere, and it's a pain for me. There's a tiny little bit in there. 0 0.0001 or something like that. So, oh, come on. And then we take this one then. So, the right, there's white one is going to be lubricant, right? Oh no, this is going to be sulfuric acid. And please go away for once. Please, please, please go away for once. So this is empty, good. Then this is just piping out this stuff. There's something right there it says. All right. So let's see if we try to pump, it, pump, pump petroleum with high pressure into this side. So the right one would be petroleum. There's going to be a mess in this corner. So the right one will be petroleum. Why is this one also petroleum? I don't know, and it's just a really tiny bit in there or something. So I guess we had a third pump, right? Yeah. Remove this part. Add the third pump. Pumping station. You connect it. Connect you. Please just make sure there's nothing in the pipe, will you? You also just... It's one big mess. Anyway. So this is not connected. Where should it be connected then? You should be connected right there and there. So now the petroleum would flood in that side. And that would mean that that's working. Also it should make the first things, or doesn't it? Does it need it something for that? Or oh, it's coal, we don't have coal. Although the system is slowly booting up. But it just needs oil and we are screwing around with oil. This pipe um, is the pipe that has sulfuric acid and it seems to be empty, so that's good. Like that. And then we take that away. So this is going to be sulfuric acid. We also could do is just implant that into the pipe again. Um, let's get that in the pipe, although it's not much. Uh, the middle pipe shouldn't be filled with something. It was only filled until there, so let's try to fix that by hand. Because the pump apparently is not working as it's supposed to. You empty, you gun, you two gun, you, you, you two gun, you. U3 gun, you. Oh, and then there's sulfuric acid again. Why doesn't this one take sulfuric acid out? So, a pump. And then, uh. Let's try again. 
Come on, pump. Take it out for once. It doesn't want to take it out. Kind of further frustrating to me. Because now I need to redo that again. I don't know why to keep doing that. Come on, developers. Try to get something better to work with your pumps for once. God's sake. Give me a pause and I will fix it. I guess this is not funny to watch. Oh, oh no, no, microphone. Yeah. It's all fixed, so it's working now. It doesn't get enough iron because this is, of course, not enough iron to be mined. So, what we could do is just uh, make sure that these also get mined. And you just place some more down. Uh, we can use substations to power the stuff. We can use belts to get the iron out of there. And then we put the belts in, and then we're going to belt the right to this side, and then loop up. And hopefully we get a little bit more. And then also we have this one that we can mine out. So minus, minus, minus. You. And then uh, three more on this side. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why don't we use uh, as much as possible as minus? All right. So we have more m more ores here that we can mine out like that, and we just. Yeah, we just connect it through the system and then uh, we just run this belt to the right side and then up and then uh, let's just connect it like that so hopefully the belt will just fill up probably should use um, uh, these boys quite a lot should make more sense like that and if we do like this, then it will probably fill the belt quite good. Let's see if we can do it right here too. Uh, somewhat. As long as it counts right. Oh, we don't need this one. Just let that go right here. Let that go down. And then something like that. But we need also belt power here apparently it's not connected so let's connect that it'd be better why isn't it still not connected like that then now we'll be connected so that's also mining up sto stone ore and all we don't need to do is just also connect up this patch a little bit now probably this is going to create a full belt of blue and then we would probably end up with more right there so I'm gonna do that for the next little while um, between the episodes uh, but for this episode, it's getting it's getting good long. Uh, I do want to make some cool things soon, like um, a system that basically um, smashes all the science specs together. <laughs> Don't know how to pronounce it else. Uh, and then uh, put it under one belt and just it puts new ones on the belt if there isn't one of the, that pack on the belt yet. And that way, uh, we would have a way efficient more. We only need to run one belt to the whole system. So that would be nice. Uh, but for now, I want to thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you in another one soon. Have a nice day. And uh, goodbye.